LCM, a structural comparison. Welcome to a quick breakdown of the structural differences between LLMs and LCMs. LLM side left. Let's start with the traditional LLM or large language model. The process begins with input, which is then passed through tokenization, where the text is broken into tokens. Next comes embedding. Converting these tokens into numerical vectors the model can understand. These vectors are processed by a transformer, the core architecture behind LLMs, to generate contextual understanding. Finally, the result is the output, a prediction or generation based on the input. This linear pipeline is powerful, but largely fixed in its structure, L side right. Now let's look at the LCM or language composition model. The journey also starts with input, but from there it takes a more dynamic path. First, sentence segmentation breaks the input into meaningful sentence units. These are then passed through sonar embedding, a richer embedding strategy capturing deeper context. The data then enters the diffusion stage, where it splits into multiple pathways, reflecting more abstract and distributed thinking. It branches into advanced patterning and a hidden process, capturing intricate relationships and latent structures. These streams converge through quantization, harmonizing the complexity into usable signals. Finally, the model produces the output, now shaped by a more layered and adaptive architecture. Conclusion. In summary, LLMs follow a linear and well-established pipeline, while LCMs adopt a multi-path compositional approach, offering richer, more nuanced language understanding. This evolution marks a significant shift in how AI comprehends and generates language.